Hey everybody, it's Jordan back again. Freddy playing Freddy Fish 3, the case of the stolen conch shell. We have to figure out how to get that uh, golden pipe then. But there's a guy here, so maybe she can help us out. What's up? Are you okay? I'd be better if my boat hadn't sprung a leak. I had to strike my sail and use it to plug the hole. Without a sail to catch the wind, I'm stuck out here. <sighs> that island has beautiful looking banana trees. I wish I could. Oh, she, she could climb the tree and get us the golden pipe. We could find something to stuff in the hole so you could hoist your sail. <coughs> that would be stupendous. Then I could get moving again. Oh, it's the plug from last time. Okay, it's like the first thing I did in the game was take a plug out. I didn't realize I could pick it up. Now we have to go all the way back. But for you guys, and the magic of editing uh, you'll be there in three two one BAM you see how easy that was for you guys I had to come all the way back <laughs> I'm just kidding it took like 30 seconds but at least you guys didn't have to sit through it I'd better hold on to this yeah I wish we would have picked that up in the beginning yeah you never know and back we go I think this is going to be like a world record run of Freddy Fish. I don't think anyone has ever completed this game that quick. Or as quick as we are at least. Here, have a plug. My poor leaking boat. Don't worry Magenta, we'll have your problem solved in a snap. Okay Luther, let her rip. No. Oh. oh. Good news. The hole's plugged. Uh, the bad news is I ripped your cell badly. I know a tailor who can fix something that's cut into a million billion pieces. Quite well. Don't worry, Magenta. We'll get your cell fixed. We promise. Now we go all the way back again. We're making a lot of trips for this golden putt. I hope Uncle Blenny appreciates it. Here we are, back again. Can you uh, sew this up for me, please, for free? Monsieur Pierre, do you think you can mend our sail for us? Oui, oui. Now observe, mere mortals. <laughs> the god of sewing is here, mere mortals. He does it with his face? What the fuck? Finny! Well, he said to say it, sheesh! Okay, Luther is definitely like on the autism spectrum. I, I, I feel bad making fun of him at this point. And back we are again for you. She had better get us this pipe for all the work we're doing. If she doesn't get this for us, I'm gonna be pissed. Also, is this monkey the only person that's not being blamed for stealing the con shell? Hey, Magenta! I'm surprised Freddy wasn't blamed. Look at him, he do look guilty. Split? No, it's the sail for your boat. Good as new. Wow, I'm impressed. And even Plot twist, there's no wind. Okay, never mind. There's a lot of wind. <laughs> Oh, it's 
a lovely island and such beautiful banana trees. Thanks for your help. No, you don't need to thank us. You need to get us that pipe, lady. This banana tree and toss us that golden pipe. It's a pleasure. There's literally gold here. And all that girl cares about lot, is bananas. Then again, then again, she was oh, stranded in the ocean, so I guess it makes sense. He can sniff out the thief. Another golden pipe found. First of all, is it mommy? Gee, I hope they can find that conch shell so we can have them. First of all, I've waited all year. <laughs> What? Don't cut it. Don't try to guilt trip me like that. That's just rude. Look, Let's see what's in here. Behind that waterfall. Wait. Oh, the fourth urchin. What? Whew. That knocked the wind out of me. Me too. We're just gonna have to find another way to get to that water. Your fish! Swim under it! Go underwater and come up on the other side! It would honestly be more comfortable for you, being underwater. Freddy, how come there are no pink polka dotted sea urchins? But there are! They live in the secret sea! But we do have enough sea urchins for the carnival, so... There might be another you just make pipe in there, but I really want to see what's on the other side of this waterfall first. Here we are, sir. Let us through. Here's a purple sea urchin. That's just That's one gotta hurt. I need three more before you guys get through the door. Hmm. Another How do you have another one, then? Purple sea urchin number two, but that ain't gonna do. Two purple sea urchins more bring the total to four. Here's another purple sea urchin. That's three purple sea urchins, and I'm one away from having enough to let you play. Oh, if only I had one more. I guess I'm gonna have to turn around. Nope. Here's our last purple sea urchin. Psych. Purple sea urchins, precisely the price of admission. And fortunately for you, too, uh, having a special. For every little yellow fish that pays admission, a little green fish gets in absolutely free. Boy, did I ever hit this on the right day. <laughs> Luther has a serious gambling problem. Put the critters up the wall. When enough of the same critters touch each other, they'll go away. If you use all the critters in the tube, you'll advance to a new level. But... Watch out! When the critters move above the bar, they won't go away. Um, I wasn't listening to any of that. Uh, okay. Oh, I see. You just gotta match them. I think. No? I thought we had to get three in a row. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, it's four. It's four. Okay, it's four. Oops. <laughs> this is a lot harder than it looks, guys. Please don't judge me. Due to a mixture of uh, this probably being super boring to watch and the fact I'm super bad at it, <laughs> I think it's just best for both of us if I skip till after this is done. Okay, there's only a couple more left. Killed it. We finished the level! Yeah. Give me that. Give me that mirror. The world famous floating fun is proud to present you with this. A fantabulous fun house mirror replica. There 
There's no time for that now, Luther. Thanks, Gil. What do we do with it? Uh... I'll figure this out. Two hours later. This president of the okay, after painstakingly showing this mirror to everyone in the game I knew, I think I finally got it right. too mean to mess with. Hey Luther, I have a plan. I can also whisper Freddy. You what? Huh? Yikes! Yeah, get bullied, bully club president. Big, stupid looking, ugly ones. Yeah, that's right, ugly. <laughs> I just want to get on this bull. That guy's dead. Okay, never mind. He's he's okay. He's okay. now? Sure. This dude is traumatized. Keep that flashlight as long as you want. Yeah, and we're going to be back when we find out you stole our magic conch shell. I think my favorite game mechanic in any game, honestly, would be the backtracking. I love it. But I know what I have to do with the flashlight. There was a dark room earlier with remember the sad guy and the actual devil? That's where we're going. Freddy, I'm a ah, don't be afraid, Luther. I have a flashlight. We have a way to do that, Luther. This flashlight will add some light, Luther, so you won't have to be afraid anymore. Who, me? I'm kind of scared to look at that fish, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Those two separate fish? Sorry. No PDA, guys. What's this guy? Are you serious? <laughs> he was just upside down this whole time? Now, is, is there something in here? <gasps> the third golden bite! Ready. Let's go back to Soggy Sniffer! Way to go, Luther! Like I said, absolutely speed running! We found all three golden pipes! Come on! Let's see if old Soggy can pick up the bad guy's scent. Here you go, boy. I think I'm going to end this one here, guys. And uh, hopefully our next episode will be the last, because we have all three. And I don't remember it taking that long to actually find the conch after, but I could be wrong. The next one could be a long one, but I'll see you then.